formula it looks like this is working I had some major Facebook issues tonight I couldn't get it to be to not have me upside down <laughs> or like sideways but it looks like it worked God bless you all Oh, I'm so happy, Louise. So I'm going to share this, and we're going to pray the rosary, and we're going to pray to St. Joseph. I'm sorry I couldn't be here yesterday. I picked up a second job just to kind of help push things along. And after that, I had mass, and it was for my parents, and they asked me to come over for dinner. And then I had to go to Lowe's to get an O-ring to fix my drain. <laughs> I'm learning all about plumbing and carpentry. Today, I painted my laundry room. And then I realized that it was after nine, which was too late. So it's just hard when there's only one person doing everything, right? So tonight at the end, instead of the short form of St. Michael, we'll pray that long form of St. Michael that we usually do on Tuesdays. But we're gonna go ahead and pray for um, Pray for our normal St. Joseph intentions. St. Joseph is a patron saint of um, men. You can pray for all the men in your life, right? Of finding a spouse, if you're longing to get married. Of um, work, if you're looking for a job or facing unjust working conditions or having financial problems. He's the patron saint of selling houses. He is the patron saint of, um, I go to him for all my financial and all of my like house things, right? He's a good head of the house. He's also a patron saint of purity. If you are struggling in that way or you're praying for your children to preserve that in this world, Pray for all of these special things that he loves to help us with. And we pray for, of course, the conversion of Russia and the triumph of the Immaculate Heart. For our work in Russia, for Kate, my Ekaterina, my Russian translator, and for the work we'll do once she finishes. We pray for our work in Poland. Pray for the Middle East and Thanksgiving for this huge meeting they have on Saturday of the Children of the Cross. We have so many children, so many adults. We ask for continued protection and for funds. They were given land to build a house to help with our ministry. So I have my house that everything kind of goes out of. And now we will have a house in Pakistan, but we'll need money for the building. So we pray that the Lord sends good donors, especially in Pakistan, from the old, their own Pakistani people, although they are poor, so that we have a place for all sorts of things. And we pray for work in Afghanistan and the spread throughout the Middle East. We pray for Africa, for all of our work in Nigeria, the Cameroon. We were able to send money today to print 2,000 more books in the Cameroon. We pray for Zanzibar and for Uganda. We need about $600 for Uganda right now. We pray for Ethiopia and our work there for the Sudan. We pray for Nicaragua and for powerful fires of God's love and prayer and grace to descend on the people who have our books here. 
We pray for Colombia and Mexico, India, all of these sisters in the United States that are so grateful for what we sent and who have their own intentions they're sending to you. We pray for those persecuted unjustly. We pray for a particular priest I know that needs lots of prayers. And we pray for all of our priests today, especially those that we've offered our life for. We pray for our families. We pray for our neighborhoods and our workplaces and all those associated with our ministry, the Children of the Cross, the Fiat Foundation, our donors, and this Bethany House of Crucified Love and Prayer. We beg the Lord to send donors personally for the house so that I'm able to live my vocation as a hermit and to run this ministry full time. We pray for the abused and the neglected, the abandoned, the trafficked, the betrayed, and the betrayed. We pray for those needing conversion, those who've left the church, those with hard hearts, erroneous hearts, cold hearts, unrepentant hearts, unforgiving hearts. We pray for those who are ill, for Levi and Charlie and Liam and Jonathan and Colton and Aubrey and Colette and Sophia and Michael and Calvin. We pray for Josephine. We pray for Nora. We pray for baby Mateo. We pray for all of those longing to conceive, those who've lost babies those longing to get married, those trying to discern their life. We pray for all of the particular people the Lord brings to us every day to pray for. We pray for Jonathan. We pray for the priest God has asked us to pray for. We pray for peace in the world, for the hierarchy of the church, for government leaders. We pray for all of the intentions on these pages, all of your intentions, and all of my intentions. I ask in your mercy that you remember my intentions. There's so many big things that the Lord has asked that um, I can't share. We start. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. O Jesus, in union with your most precious blood, poured out on the cross and offered in every Mass, I offer you today my prayers, works, joys, sorrows, and sufferings for the praise of your holy name, all the desires of your sacred heart, in reparation for sin, for the conversion of sinners, the union of all Christians, for all of the intentions of my heart, and for a final union with you in heaven. Amen. My queen and my mother, I give myself entirely to you. To show my devotion to you, I consecrate to you this day. My eyes, my ears, my mouth, my heart, my entire self without reserve. Wherefore, good mother, as I am thy own, keep me and guard me as thy property and possession. Amen. Oh, that you would bless me indeed and enlarge my territory, that your hand would be with me and you would keep me from evil, that I may not cause pain. I believe in God, the Father, the Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell on the third day. He rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father, the Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. We pray for Pope Francis, for the cardinals, the archbishops, bishops, and the priests who work for them. We pray for their physical and spiritual protection, for their intentions, for their conversions, for humility and integrity, wisdom, knowledge, understanding, right judgment, courage, and fortitude, generosity, reparation, and love. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. 
kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For an increase of faith, hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For an increase of hope, hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For an increase of love, charity, and conversion. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. And here, on this Wednesday, we're going to pray the Glorious Mysteries. And I forgot to bring the other book over with the long version of the litany, so we'll pray the short one. The first glorious mystery is the resurrection of Jesus from the dead. And in this mystery, as Jesus is risen from the dead, he goes again to his foster father who had died, who was waiting in limbo to be released into heaven. He embraces him. He goes to Our Lady and he embraces her. And maybe he brought Joseph to Our Lady. Maybe once Joseph was resurrected into heaven, Jesus, who appeared in the resurrection to Our Lady, brought a vision of Joseph, you know? Think about the saints as I have seen Joseph. Why not Our Lady? But there was a great joy in the reconciliation of the Holy Family in the resurrection. And it is because um, jo Joseph and Mary were the real parents of Jesus. Joseph was the real husband of Our Lady, the real father of, of a caretaker and provider for Jesus. And there was not just a divine love of the Holy Spirit between them, which was true. There was a human love. There was a filial love. So often in today's world, people think that um, if you love, that it has to be either like romantic or it had there has to be something kind of impure about it that the saints you know they only loved people in a divine way but that's not true there was a great human affinity between many of the saints and when we study the sacred heart of jesus he doesn't only love us with a divine love but he loves us as a man so in this mystery, we pray for all families, for all friendships, all graced friendships and relationships, for all of the work that the Lord has asked each one of us to do in this world, that the Lord may bless our relationships with priests, with those in our ministry, with those who we live with or we serve, with not only the power of a divine love, but with um, a a human love um, that is elevated to the way that God intended for humans to love each other, right? How beautiful, what peace would reign on earth in that way. We ask St. Joseph to pray for us. St. Joseph, renowned offspring of David, pray for us. Light of the patriarchs, pray for us. Spouse of the mother of God, pray for us. Chaste guardian of the Virgin, pray for us. Foster father of the Son of God, pray for us. Diligent protector of Christ, pray for us. Head of the Holy Family, pray for us. Our Father, who art in heaven, 
Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, help especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by the means of the powerful intercession of the Immaculate Heart of Mary thy well-beloved spouse. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The second glorious mystery is the ascension into heaven. In this mystery, Jesus was taken up into heaven and the apostles and the disciples and our lady standing there, their eyes were raised to heaven. He physically, he didn't just vanish, he physically ascended to take their eyes, their minds to the heavens to remind them that they should always live like Father Flanagan, the founder of SALT, the Society of Our Lady of the Most Holy Trinity, he used to always say we should live with our minds in heaven, 
our feet on the earth and our heart on the cross. And um, Jesus ascended to bring our minds to heaven. St. Joseph had to live all of his days, especially as the husband of Mary and the father of Jesus, with his mind in heaven, united with God the Father. But he was taking the place of God the Son's father eternally, right? His eternal father. But he had all those gifts given to him to guide Jesus with the mind of the Father. He didn't follow human prudence. He followed divine prudence, right? People would have said it was very stupid and scandalous to marry a pregnant woman that was not pregnant with your child. But God told him to and he obeyed. He didn't care what the world said. And it would be humanly stupid to stand up in the middle of the night and take your family to a pagan country of Egypt where you have no work and no home. But it was divinely prudent to follow what the Lord had asked. In this mystery, we want to unite our minds to Joseph and Mary and Jesus in heaven. We want to pray that we have the mind of Christ, just like St. Paul says in Scripture. We want to pray for divine wisdom, knowledge, understanding, right, judgment, discernment. We also want to offer the Lord every thought that we had today. And we ask him to purify it. If it was a prayer, to answer those prayers. If we were thinking about different people, that they may be blessed. We want to unite our minds from today. St. Joseph, most just, pray for us. St. Joseph, most merciful, pray for us. St. Joseph, most chaste and modest and pure, pray for us. St. Joseph, most discerning and prudent and wise and understanding and knowledgeable, pray for us. St. Joseph, most humble and docile and obedient, pray for us. St. Joseph, most hopeful and trusting, pray for us. The Ascension. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Russian, Radusia Maria, Blagadepti Polnaya, Gaspodsta Boyne. Blagoslavia Natinez, the Sholomi, the Blagoslavia Pochereva, Taya Bogisis, Svetaya Maria, Mater Boja, Malisa Naskarishi, Nimi Ivchas, Mirti Nashi Amen, Polish, Strobosh, Maria Waski Pauna Pan Sabo, Bogoslavionish, Tinians and Avasami. I bogoslavioni ovoc života Twojego Jezus. Święta Maria, Matka Boża, mudl się za nami przez dni. Teraz i w godzina i śmierci naszej. Amen. Spieraj. Dios te salve Maria, llena de este gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tu eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de vientre Jesús. Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y a la hora de nuestra muerte. Amen. Italian, Ave Maria, piena de gracia, el Señor y con te. Tu se benedetta fra le donne y benedetto el fruto del tuo seno, Jesus. Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, Prega per noi peccadori, adesso la hora della nostra muerte. Amen. Italian. I'm sorry, Latin. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum. Benedicta tu in mulieribus et benedictus, fructus ventris tu, Jesus. Santa Maria, Mater Dei, or pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in hora mortis nostri. Amen. Russian. Radusia Maria, Blagadati Polnaya Gaspodsta Boyne, Blagoslavienna Tinez de Jonami, 
Keep like a slug in Pledgeva, Ayavo Isis, Svetaya Maria, Mater Boja, Malisanas Krishna, Nini Ikcha Smirti Nashi Anna, Kolosh, Strovash Maria Waski Pauna Pansabo, Bogaswavionash Tiente Nevasami, Ki Bogaswavioni Ava Shavata Tayega Yezu. Shrenda Maria Matka Boja, Mudalsha Zanami Jishmini, Tera Zivgojina Ishmir Jinashi Anna, Spanish. Dios te salve Maria, Yanares de Gracia, El Senores Contigo, Bendita tu eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de vientre Jesús. Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, Rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Ave María, llena de gracia, el Señor y conté. Tu se benedicta, pro la donne y benedicto el fruto del tu Señor Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, adesso en la hora de la nuestra muerte. Amén. Latin, Ave Maria, gratia plena Dominus Tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus, fructus ventris tui Jesus. Santa Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in hora mortis nostri, Amen. Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritu, Santo, sic unerat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, help especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by the means of a powerful intercession the Immaculate Heart of Mary, thy well-beloved spouse. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Spirit upon the apostles at Pentecost. And in this mystery, the Holy Spirit came upon the apostles in a very visible way with tongues of fire and with the wind and with um, teaching them languages. And they had this powerful courage to go forth and preach the gospel. And yet the Holy Spirit sometimes doesn't come to us with that boom and that bang. Sometimes he comes like he did to Elijah with a still, small voice. That's the way, excuse me, that he guided Joseph. Sometimes the Holy Spirit doesn't give us courage where we're not afraid. Instead, he gives us the gifts that Christ had crucified, a faithfulness in the midst of fear and terror. Sometimes the Holy Spirit takes the cross from us. Like where, you know, Azariah um, and, what is it? Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, right? <laughs> that they were um, in the fire and they didn't feel the flames and they weren't burned. Sometimes the martyrs have that gift where they weren't, they didn't feel pain. But sometimes... Sometimes the Holy Spirit just keeps us faithful in the midst of pain, in the midst of suffering, just like he kept our lady faithful under the cross. So in this mystery, we just pray that the Holy Spirit may light and fire all of our beings in whatever way he sees fit, in whatever way will glorify the Father the most. We give him our bodies, our minds, our hearts, our souls, our spirits, our memories, our past, our present, our future. We give them our relationships, our words, 
our mistakes, our desires, our actions, our needs. We give up everything and we ask the Holy Spirit through the intercession of Joseph to set us on fire with divine love. St. Joseph, most strong, pray for us. St. Joseph, most gentle, pray for us. St. Joseph, most obedient, pray for us. St. Joseph, most passionate, pray for us. St. Joseph, most faithful, pray for us. The descent of the Holy Spirit, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, help especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by the means of the powerful intercession of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, thy well-beloved spouse. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fourth glorious mystery is the assumption of Our Lady into heaven, body and soul. In this mystery, we remember how Our Lady fell asleep and went to heaven, body and soul. And it's because she was full of God. She was immaculate. 
She was perfectly humble and empty of herself. She was perfectly pure, a translucent vessel. In this mystery, we pray for humility and purity to match our ladies. We pray for these two virtues to increase in, these, in the world, among the youth, in our families, in our homes, our neighborhoods, our workplaces, in our own hearts, our relationships. We pray for authentic, humility and purity to reign within the hearts of the hierarchy of the church and the priests and the religions and marriages. And we ask St. Joseph, who also embodied these virtues, to pray for us. St. Joseph, mirror of patience, pray for us. Lover of poverty, pray for us. Model of artisans, pray for us. Glory of the home life, pray for us. Guardian of virgins, pray for us. Pillar of families, pray for us. The Assumption, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, amen. Russian. Radio Sia Maria, Lagada di Polnaya, Gaspot Saboyni, Lagaslavian Natinia Shishonani, I Blagaslavian Plochereva, Tvaya Bo Isus, Svetaya Maria, Mater Boja, Malisana Skrushni, Nini Ivchas Smirti Nashi, Amen. Polish. Strobash Maria Waski Pauna Pan Sabo Bogoswavionash Timienza Nevastami I Bogoswavioni Ova Shivata Tayeko Jesus Shventa Maria Matka Boja Mudelshev Zanami Shishnini Teras I Pugina I Shmirchina Shi Ana Spanish, Dios te salve Maria, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tu eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito el se fruto y vientre Jesús. Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y a la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Italian, Ave Maria, Piena de gracia, el Señor y conté, tu se benedicta fra la donne y benedicto el fruto del tuo Señor Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, prega per noi pecadori, adesso en la hora de la nuestra muerte. Amén. Latin, Ave María, gracia plena, Dominus tecum. Benedicta tui mulieribus et benedictus, fructus ventris tui Jesus. Santa Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in ora mortis nostri. Amen. Russian, Radiusia Maria, Blagadati Polnaya, Gaspod Staboyni, Blagoslavien Matinez de Jomeni, I blagoslavien plochereva, tvaya bo isus. Svetaya Maria, mater boja, malisana skrishni. Nini ivcha smirti nashi amen, polish. Strovash Maria, waski pauna pan sabo. Bogoslavionash timienza nevastami. I bogoslavioni, ova shivata, tvayego jesus. Shventa Maria Matka Boja, Mudal Shizanami Shishnini, Terra Sif Gojina I Shmirjina Shi Amen, Spanish. Dios te salve Maria, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tu eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito el se fruto de vientre Jesús. Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, Rega por nosotros, pecadores, ahora y la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Italian. 
Ave Maria, piena di grazia, el Signore è con te. Tu sei benedetta fra le donne, e benedetto il frutto del tuo segno, Gesù. Santa Maria, Mater, Madre di Dio, prega per noi peccatori, adesso al nell'ora del nostro muerte. Amen. Latin Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus et benedictus, fructus ventris tui Jesus. Santa Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in ora mortis nostri. Amen. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, Sicurera in principio et nunc et sempre, et in secula seculorum. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, help especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by the means of the powerful intercession of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, thy well-beloved spouse. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fifth glorious mystery, the coronation of Our Lady, Queen of Heaven and Earth. In this mystery, we consecrate ourselves to Our Lady as our Queen and Joseph as our King. And we ask them to present us to Christ the King in Heaven. We ask for them to protect, to provide, to guide, to enlighten every aspect of our life personal lives, our families, our home and property, our relationships, our work, our neighborhoods, our ministry, the Fiat Foundation, the Children of the Cross, the Bethany House of Crucified Love and Prayer, our priests, our work. St. Joseph Salus of the Wretched, Pray for us, hope of the sick. Pray for us, patron of the dying. Pray for us, tear of demons. Pray for us, protector of the Holy Church. Pray for us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and
and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, help especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by the means of a powerful intercession the Immaculate Heart of Mary, thy well-beloved spouse. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we set up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, O most gracious advocate, thy eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, we pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us rewards of eternal life, grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating on the mystery of the most holy rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, that we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to thy protection implored thy help or sought thy intercession was left unaided inspired by this confidence we fly unto thee o virgin of virgins our mother to thee do we come before thee we stand sinful and sorrowful o mother of the word incarnate despise not our petitions but in thy mercy hear and answer us amen O Saint Joseph, whose protection is so great, so strong, so proud before the throne of God, I place in you all my interests and desires. O Saint Joseph, do assist me by your powerful intercession, and obtain for me from your divine Son all spiritual blessings through Jesus Christ our Lord, so that having engaged here below your heavenly power, I may offer my thanksgiving and homage to the most loving of fathers. O Saint Joseph, I never weary contemplating you, and Jesus asleep in your arms. I dare not approach while he reposes near your heart. Press him in my name, kiss his fine head for me. Ask him to return the kiss when I draw my dying breath. Saint Joseph, patron of departing souls, pray for me. O Saint Joseph, terror of demons, cast thy solemn gaze upon the devil and his minions. Protect us with thy mighty staff. You fled through the night to avoid the devil's wicked designs. Now, with the power of God, smite the demons as they flee from thee. Grant special protection, we pray, for children and the unborn, families and relationships, work and ministries, homes and possessions, persecuted Christians, priests, and the dying. By God's grace, no demon dares approach while you are near. So we beg of you, St. Joseph, always be near to us. Amen. 
and we'll pray the long form of the St. Michael prayer. O glorious Prince of a heavenly host, St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in the battle and in the terrible warfare that we're waging against the principalities and powers, against rulers of this world of darkness and against evil spirits. Come to the aid of man whom Almighty God created immortal, made in his own image and likeness and redeemed at a great price from the tyranny of Satan. Fight this day the battle of the Lord together with the holy angels, as already thou hast fought the leader of the proud angels, Lucifer and his apostate host, who were powerless to resist thee, nor was there place for them any longer in heaven. That cruel ancient serpent who is called the devil or Satan, who seduces the whole world, was cast into the abyss with his angels. Behold, this primeval enemy and slayer of men has taken courage. Transformed into an angel of light, he wanders about with all the multitude of wicked spirits, invading the earth in order to blot out the name of God and of his Christ, to cease upon slay and cast into eternal perdition souls destined for the crown of eternal glory. This wicked dragon pours out as a most impure flood the venom of his malice on men of depraved mind and corrupt heart, the spirit of lying and piety and blasphemy, the pestilent breath of impurity, and every vice and iniquity. These most crafty enemies have filled and inebriated with gall and bitterness the church, the spouse of the Immaculate Lamb, and have laid in pious hands and her most sacred possessions. In the holy place itself, where the sea of holy Peter and the chair of truth has been set up as a light of the world, they have raised the throne of their abominable impiety, with the iniquitous design that when the pastor has been struck, the sheep may be scattered. Arise, then, O invincible prince, and bring help against the attacks of the lost spirits to the people of God, and give them the victory. They venerate thee as their protector and patron. In thee, holy church, glories as their defense against the malicious powers of hell. To thee as God entrusted the souls of men to be established in heavenly beatitude. Pray to the God of peace that he may put Satan under our feet, so far conquered that he may no longer be able to hold men in captivity and harm the church. Offer our prayers in the sight of the Most High, so that they may quickly find mercy in the sight of the Lord, and vanquishing the dragon, the ancient serpent who is the devil and Satan. Do thou again make him captive in the abyss, that he may no longer seduce the nations. Amen. Behold the cross of the Lord, be scattered ye hostile powers. The lion of the tribe of Judah has conquered the root of David. Let thy mercy be on us, O Lord, as we have hoped in thee. Lord, hear our prayer, let our cry come unto thee, let us pray. O God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, we call upon thy holy name. And as supplicants we implore thy clemency, that by the intercession of Mary, of her virgin immaculate and our mother, of the glorious St. Michael the Archangel, thou wouldst dying to help us against Satan and all the other unclean spirits who wander about the world for the injury of the human race and the ruin of souls. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit. Angels of God, our guardians dear, to whom God's love commits us here, ever this night be at our side, to light and guard, to rule and guide. Amen. And we pray for those who have died, those in our families, our friends, our benefactors, those who we've worked for, those who we've promised to pray for, those who lived in our homes, our neighborhoods, our parishes, and those in greatest need. Eternal rest grant unto them, O Lord, and may your perpetual light shine upon them. May their souls and all the souls of the faithful departed through the mercy of God rest in peace. Eternal God, we offer to you the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus in union with the masses said throughout the world for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, those in the universal church, within our own home and within our own family. Amen. We pray at St. Patrick's breastplate prayer. I arise today through a mighty strength, the invocation of the Trinity, through belief in the threeness, through confession of the oneness of the creator of creation. I arise today through the strength of Christ's birth with his baptism, through the strength of his crucifixion with his burial, through the strength of his resurrection with his ascension, 
through the strength of his descent for the judgment of doom. I arise today through the strength of the love of the cherubim, in the obedience of the angels, the service of the archangels, in the hope of resurrection to meet with reward, in the prayers of patriarchs, predictions of prophets, in the preaching of apostles, in the faith of confessors, in the innocence of holy virgins and the deeds of righteous men. I arise today through the strength of heaven, the light of the sun, the radiance of the moon, the splendor of fire, the speed of lightning, the swiftness of wind, the depth of the sea, the stability of the earth, and the firmness of rock. I arise today through God's strength to pilot me, God's might to uphold me, God's wisdom to guide me. God's eye to look before me, God's ear to hear me, God's word to speak for me, God's hand to guard me, God's shield to protect me, God's host to save me. From the snares of the devil, from temptations of vices, from everyone who shall wish me ill, afar and near. I summon today all these powers between me and those evils against every cruel and merciless power that may oppose my body and soul against incantations of false prophets and black laws of paganism, false laws of heretics and the craft of idolatry, against spells of witches and smiths, wizards, satanists, and warlords, and against every knowledge that corrupts man's body and soul. Jesus Christ has shield me today against poison and burning, choking and suffocating, destruction and accidents, pestilence, infestation and plague, against drowning and wounding, sickness and calumny, against jealousy, competition, blocking and division, against disobedience, disrespect, profanity, immodesty, unchastity, impurity, tantrums, violence, unrepentance, unforgiveness, misunderstanding, confusion, unrepentance, unforgiveness, greed, despair, discouragement, rash or false judgment, vanity, selfishness, and pride, against anger and lust, dishonesty and betrayal, denial, abandonment, debt, rejection, indifference, unfaithfulness, and every other evil that could come against me or those for whom I'm praying, so that there may come to us instead an abundance of reward. Jesus Christ be with me, Jesus Christ before me. Jesus Christ behind me, Jesus Christ in me, Jesus Christ beneath me, Jesus Christ above me, Jesus Christ on my right, Jesus Christ on my left, Jesus Christ when I lie down, Jesus Christ when I sit down, Jesus Christ when I arise, Jesus Christ in the heart of every man who thinks of me, Jesus Christ in the mouth of everyone who speaks of me. Jesus Christ in every eye that sees me, Jesus Christ in every ear that hears me. I arise today through a mighty strength, the invocation of the Trinity, through belief in the threeness, through confession of the oneness of the creator of creation. Amen. And on Wednesdays, we pray our consecration to St. Joseph. But you know what? We didn't get to do our consecration to St. Michael yesterday. Let's do that, and then we'll do the consecration to St. Joseph. O most noble prince of the angelic hierarchies, valorous warrior of Almighty God, zealous lover of his glory, terror of the rebellious angels, love and delight of all the just angels, my beloved archangel, St. Michael, Desiring to be numbered among your devoted servants, I today offer and consecrate myself to you, and I place myself, my family, my relationships, my home, my property, my possessions, my work, my ministry, the Fiat Foundation, the Children of the Cross, all that I do, all that I need, all that I possess under your most powerful protection. I entreat you not to look at how little eyes your servant have to offer being only a wretched sinner, but to gaze rather with favorable eye at the heartfelt affection with which his offering is made. And remember that if from this day onward I am under your patronage, 
You must during all of my life assist me and procure for me the pardon of my many grievous offenses and sins, the grace to love with all my heart my God and Savior Jesus, my sweet Mother Mary, and to obtain for me all the help necessary to arrive at my crown of glory. Defend me always from my temporal and spiritual enemies, particularly in the last moments of my life. Come then, O glorious Prince, and succor me in my last struggle. With your powerful weapon cast far from me into the infernal abysses, that provocator and proud angel that one day you prostrated in the celestial battle. Amen. And now our prayer to St. Joseph. O glorious Patriarch St. Joseph, you who were chosen by God above all men to be the earthly head of the most holy of families, I beseech you to accept me within the folds of your holy cloak, that you may become the guardian and custodian of my body and soul. From this moment on, I choose you as my father and brother, protector and defender, counselor and guide, patron and provider, and I beseech you to place in your custody my body, mind, heart, soul, emotions and memory, past, present, and future, my family and relationships, home, property, and possessions, and finances, my work and ministry, the Fiat Foundation, the Children of the Cross, this Bethany House of Crucified Love and Prayer, my vocation, all that I am, all that I desire, all that I need, all that I possess, my life and my death. Look upon me as one of your children and defend me from the treachery of my enemies, both visible and invisible. Assist me at all times and all my necessities. Console me in the bitterness of my life, especially at the hour of my death. Say but one word for me to the divine Redeemer, whom you were deemed worthy to hold in your arms, and to the Blessed Virgin Mary, your most chaste spouse. Request for me those blessings which will lead me to salvation. Include me among those who are most dear to you, and I shall set forth to prove myself worthy of your special patronage. Amen. O glorious patriarch and patron of the church, O virgin spouse of the virgin mother of God, O guardian and virginal father of the word incarnate, in the presence of Jesus and Mary, I choose you this day to be my father and guardian, protector and defender, provider and guide. O great Saint Joseph, whom God has made the head of the holy family, Accept me, I beseech you, though utterly unworthy to be a member of your holy house. Present me to your immaculate spouse, and ask her also to adopt me as her child. With her, pray that I may constantly think of Jesus and serve him faithfully to the end of my life. O terror of demons, increase in me virtue, protect me from the evil one, and help me not to offend God in any way. O oh, my spiritual Father, I hereby consecrate myself to you. In faithful imitation of Jesus and Mary, I place myself and all of my concerns under your care and protection. To you, after Jesus and Mary, I consecrate my body and soul with all their faculties, my spiritual growth, my family and relationships, home and possessions, finances, work, ministry, vocation, and all my affairs and undertakings. Forsake me not, but adopt me as a servant and child of the Holy Family. Watch over me at all times, especially at the hour of my death. Console and strengthen me with the presence of Jesus and Mary, so that with you I may praise and adore the Holy Trinity for all eternity. Amen. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Jesus, meek and humble of heart, make our hearts like unto thine. Most sacred heart of Jesus, have mercy on us. Immaculate and sorrowful heart of our lady, pray for us. Good Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Matthias, Pray for us, St. Gemma, pray for us, St. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, pray for us, St. George, pray for us, St. Timothy and Titus, Barnabas, Rita and Jude, Philomena, pray for us. All you holy angels, pray for us, all you holy martyrs, pray for us, all you holy saints, pray for us. 
to rise with Sue, Teresa of Avila, and John of the Cross. Pray for us, Padre Pio and John Vianney. Pray for us. Vincent de Paul, pray for us. Miriam, the little Arab, pray for us. Saint Charbel and Saint Charles, the Hukko, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Alleluia. Thank you for praying. We didn't get kicked off Facebook. It's a miracle. It's the first time, I think, in two weeks. So our prayers are a working. Um, I will be back tomorrow, earlier, I promise. Oh my goodness, my legs. God be with you. Oh, don't get old. <laughs>